In this video, I'm going to show you how to get black cinematic bars into LumaFusion. Hey there, I'm Mark Brown from Editor's Keys. Now, if you use LumaFusion or you're a filmmaker, consider subscribing to the channel because we've got tons of videos about how to achieve the cinematic look. We've got free LUTs for LumaFusion and loads more tutorials for LumaFusion on the channel. Now, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to add black bars the correct way into LumaFusion. Now, I've seen a lot of YouTube videos on this subject and there is honestly a lot of bad advice out there. Now, the first bit of advice people say to do is use something like an adjustment layer and then crop down your footage. That honestly won't work. And then the second bit of bad advice I've seen is people say import from Photoshop some PNG black bars and slap them onto your footage in LumaFusion. Now, these methods won't work for a number of reasons. And if you're viewing the footage on monitors which are not 16 by nine, you'll actually see that your bars will either disappear completely or you'll have extra thick bars because of the way that the monitor is displaying that footage. So what I'm gonna do now is we're gonna jump into LumaFusion and I'm just gonna show you how you can just change your aspect ratio and get black bars the correct way. Okay, so we've jumped into LumaFusion and this is what you will normally see. This is a 16 by nine uh, project. But essentially all you need to do um, to change the aspect ratio and get those black cinematic bars the right way is create a new project. So if we go down here to the left, uh, we're gonna create a new project and we're gonna give it a name. We're gonna call this Cinema Bars. Uh, our frame rate is 25 frames a second. And then it just changed the aspect ratio. Now to get the kind of anamorphic aspect ratio, which gives you those really nice cinematic bars, scroll down here until you get to 2.36 to one, and then click plus. And that is essentially it. If we bring a clip in, let's uh, pull in this bit of uh, footage that we got the other day from the roof garden. You can see here, the footage has already got these black bars on. And look at that it's added in that black bar there because this is now the correct aspect ratio. You'll see if we uh, drag another clip on here, the whole timeline is done. You don't need to add any PNGs to achieve this look. Now remember, the footage we've got is 4K. LumaFusion will kind of do this automatically, so now you should be able to pull in 1080p clips, 720p clips, and it will keep this aspect ratio for your footage. And that's really all there is to it. So there we go, that is all there is to it. It's super fast and super simple. Now I've seen videos that are over 15 minutes long on this subject and they really don't need to be because this is the right way to do it. So I hope that helped you and let me know in the comments section below if it did. So thanks for watching and if you wanna see more videos on LumaFusion, we've got some uh, cinematic LUTs for LumaFusion on some of our other videos which you can see up here. Make sure you subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell to be notified of our next LumaFusion tutorial. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.